talk to me about the broader sort of continuous improvement framework to help our guests maybe understand how automation might fit inside of that. So at first it was, automation was seen as like the golden egg or the silver bullet. Uh, um, I'm just not sure about the vernacular, but um, so, but then we, we started to realize that it should be part of a framework where you should like look at a process and say, okay, eliminate stuff. So we don't want to do this anymore at, at the first place. And then we, we standardize, we simplify, and then we automate. So it's part of a, of an overall process instead of just saying, Hey, let's let's throw some automation at a process that's not so good and then yeah. we sit there and wait for the the uh, the savings to roll in yeah uh, because they don't they don't yeah no. turns out bad processes are bad whether robots are doing them or people yeah and and uh, yes and and um if you don't have your process standardized or even this uh, have described it well you spend a lot of time automating it um, and then they look at you and say, hey, why didn't it take 12 weeks as it said on the box, right? Yeah. So, right. Yeah, yeah and, and then you're mad at vendors and you're mad at technologists and yeah. Yeah, and the whole IT landscape comes crashing down on you and then, yeah, then, and then everybody's looking at you. <laughs> yeah, yeah, absolutely. I, I really like that framing and that, that's been a recurring topic on, on the podcast, which is in the last few years, as automation centers of excellence have really started to mature and kind of figure out what they are and how to operate uh, efficiently, getting to what's the right process before you get to what's the right automation, um, I think has been a really transformative idea in the space. Absolutely. And it's not a very popular uh, uh, opinion because no. people go to to these vendors and, and they and the vendor will say, well, we, we can just automate this in 12 weeks. For sure. But you have to do some work. Yeah. Beforehand. You have to know what you have to know what this is, right? Exactly. And the vendor exactly. the vendor doesn't, right? They don't know what you're doing. No. So if yeah. you know what this is, then then you can go quickly. And and that's the whole so I see this more as like a, an a, a, an integral part of continuing continuous improvement. Uh, where where automation is one of the things in the toolbox and then it yeah. could be very cool and it can be yeah. very very helpful 